Hey man. I'm not talking yet because we've got zero viewers so far. Sick, we lost everyone yeah. for the uh, <laughs> technical difficulties. Understandable to be honest. Yeah. Um, where's stream control? That all been set up adequately. We'll just swap that over. Three, two, one, you gotta put go. it there, uh, characters. Uh, yes, we do. Okay, so Q playing Inkling. This is a wow. relatively new pick for him. I so haven't seen him play that before. Yeah, so this man, on Friday, he played nine different characters really? in brackets. He swapped, wow. he swapped just about every game. It was Who completely did he play? ridiculous. Who was he playing? So he played Pikachu, Pichu, Inkling, Zelda, <laughs> um, Marth, Samus, Mario, wow. Corrin, Yoshi. He's just trying to find something new to do. He's he, uh, clearly sticking to one character is just too boring for him. Obviously. He needs to mix himself up a dozen times per tournament. That's insane. Um, but the Inkling's a relatively new one. Like, we've all seen the Korin before, we've seen the Mario, we've seen the yeah. Yoshi. He's played yeah. them in prior tournaments. But, like, Friday was the debut of this Inkling. Debut of Inkling. Wow, and it's working for him. Apparently, he's been practicing a fair bit because he's definitely got, like, his combos down. He's getting his damage yeah, output really he well. he knows what he's doing. Yeah, for sure. It's actually, um, it was quite impressive. Like, he beat Stabby J, a ranked player, with this brand new Inkling. Wow. Um, That's pretty impressive. Um... Patrick and um, Blue, uh, similar sort of situation. He's someone who's sort of swapped mains every yeah. month or so. Yeah. So Lucina is sort of it up. is new this weekend, I believe. Like he's been playing her in friendlies a fair bit uh, when we've had those sessions. But um, as far as tournament, I believe this is the first time he's playing her. That's fair. That's fair. Um, yeah, I couldn't quite remember seeing him play before today. So nah, like in prior tournaments, he'd play like DK or Ike mm. and. Yeah, characters like that. Um, we do have some viewers back now, which is nice to see. Hello, uh, viewers. Sorry hello, for friendos. all our technical difficulties, ah, but sorry. we do seem yes. to be back now. Um, oh, all right. So this is not winners' semis. No. <laughs> sorry about that. That was the last match. All right, so I think one of the key things about Inkling in general is just how slippery they are. Mm. And I was, you know, oh, they're covered in ink, haha. But like trying to land, trying to land a hit, trying to rack up the damage, but especially just trying to find a killing blow yeah, yeah. on this character can be so difficult. They're pretty, pretty short, pretty low to the ground as well. Yeah, they're short, they're quick, they don't have a lot of lag on any of their moves. Yeah. So it can just, especially playing defensively, you can just hold a lead like that. Like Patrick was almost unable to get a hit for that entire yeah. stock. Uh, before he lost his. Yeah, Q's definitely been practicing because he, he's playing it well. Mm. This is completely safe, by the way. Like, I mean, he held shield for too long and got grabbed for it. But, like, if you try and go in and attack while they're shooting like that, you just... It's you, no point. You get, oh, my goodness, the deep edge guard wow. catching you completely off guard and brings it back to an even game after a huge deficit. Very nice. Yeah, Q definitely had the lead there, but now it's far more even. They're looking like an ocean. Oh my goodness, watch oh, out for the roll. <laughs> love that. That character will just hunt you down. If you press the button, you just you're in the ground. Yeah, you are you're stuck. <laughs> you're in a lot There's of trouble. Nothing you can do about it. Yep. Definitely one of those moves that you want to be able to to read and get it, get out the way of oh. and not get trapped in. See, I don't even like reading it. Oh my goodness. Oh, SD, no. Air dodging off stage. Super unfortunate for oh. Q. Uh, but super fortunate for Q, yes. super unfortunate for Patrick. <laughs> um, yeah, that is a big shame. See, in general, with the roller, I don't even like to be anywhere where I have to react. Like, yeah. sorry, read it. I want to stay a hell away from super Inkling. Super far away. <laughs> so that if he pulls it out, I can just react to it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> reading, no, Reading's hard. There's, yeah. there's a lot of guesswork. I, I want to be able to you see gotta it coming. You've got to know the other character very well, and that can be difficult, especially if it's not a character that you've ever played before or you've ever had much to do with before, like if you've never versed yeah, something like sure. that, how are you going to be able to read it? Exactly. And especially like playing a new uh, guy playing that character, everyone's going to have their different yeah, uh, yeah, rith yeah. rhythm to the way they want to play the match, yeah, their different of course. flow, so to speak. Yeah, um, so it makes So it trying to figure harder. out when he's going to pull it out, as opposed mm. to how, for instance, Russ might pull it out, it's a completely different ball game. Yeah, so it's just yeah. a lot safer to just... Yeah, stay the hell away from the, the range. character that you have to be reading. It's the person playing the character as well, for exactly sure. Which right. definitely gives Q the advantage because he seems to know what he's doing with this character. He's been practicing in secret. And Patrick and yeah, hasn't definitely played this matchup before. Definitely not this matchup. Um, 
and yeah, like in general, we're sort of down on inkling practice since our premier inkling uh, quit yeah. the game about three months ago. Yeah, I haven't seen him around. So like, I know that uh, two different people lost to inklings at BAM when we went to Melbourne because we just, we don't have practice in this matchup yeah. anymore. We're not sure. Don't you know, know how to play it, yeah. We've forgotten the timing well, if, for if, everything. If nobody's, oh, if you're never clipped. versing it, it's, it's really hard. You can't just yeah, like, jump back into it. You can only get character knowledge from playing against them. Yeah, of course. Um, so yeah, it's uh, Why did, um, why did he stop? Uh, Carl's, uh, Rust is in his final year of uni, and uh, so he's just very busy. Yeah, no, that makes total sense. Yeah, it's a completely fair reason if we, even if we miss him dearly. Yeah. Nah, but studies come first, and you have to prioritize things like Absolutely. that, so that makes sense. Um, anyway, while we've been talking, uh, Patrick has, uh, Blue has amassed a pretty sizable lead. He yeah. went for a pretty deep edge guard, actually catching Q unawares off stage again. Um, not an easy thing to do with Inkling with their slew of mix-ups off stage. They can take their time yeah. off stage to get back, so uh, it's hard to catch them sometimes. But he's sort of playing this Managed close to, to the chest, not not just throwing out anything unsafe, and so his, his lead is surmounting. Nice. And that's what you want. Yep. Nice and safe options. Not giving Q a whole lot of room to breathe. Ooh, good dash away. Still is this fine. a best of three or a best of five? Uh, this will be a best of five. Nice. Ooh, catch them with the down Very air. Nice. Picking up that lead substantially now. Yeah, I mean, this is the situation where Q really has to be more proactive in trying to make something happen yeah. so that he can pull this back. He has to play a bit more aggressively. That's, that's part of what having a lead is the advantage, is because you know that somebody else has to make something mm. happen. They have to take more they risks. They have to, yeah, the, you're and putting so much more pressure on them to have to step up and yeah, play right. a bit differently. And so that's exactly how Patrick got that kill. He just saw Q, he's wanting to get that kill. He's desperate to bring it closer and uh, you're overextended. Yeah. He did something unsafe, he got called out. That's what happens. Now at least uh, he's managing to pull this a bit back with Inkling's completely oppressive sort of combo game. Like he hit him once mm -hmm. and just kept him in a bad spot until yeah. he was at 66. Yeah. This is sort of what Inkling gets to see. Look, you can't punish Same thing safe. again, yeah. It's completely safe. Unfortunately, once you get caught, there's not much you can do. Not really. You just gotta wait and ride it out and then <laughs> come back Ooh, up. Ooh, pressing there, there when it he's is. in a bad spot. He's gonna get caught out for that. Definitely that took control of that lead and um, yeah, for sure. utilized that. It's awesome. And Cork, you just press some buttons when he just was in no position to. Yeah. He wasn't anywhere near Patrick in the first place and he was swinging yeah. for some reason. So he's gotten caught. Yeah, starting to show his inexperience with the character just a Perhaps. little bit there. Perhaps. Let's see if we get a switch. Because a few switches there, actually. I can't believe this. Another He's Donkey Kong, amazing. Another brand new character we've never seen. Can you yeah. pull out Donkey Kong in tournament? Of all the nine characters he <laughs> used on Friday, he this still, wasn't one of them. He, he still, still has, has more up his sleep. He's still got more, more to go. tricks. Who knew? I can't believe this. Q, what have you been doing at home, man? It's not even like similar characters. That, yeah. You know, like he's gone like from from one end to the other. Swords to projectiles to a real slippery to a big heavy. Yeah. Like they're they're across all archetypes. Very strange. It's, it's actually unbelievable. Patrick, uh, lazy recovery didn't snap to ledge. He sort of a uh, misspaced it a little bit and got called out. Um, well, Lucina has a really safe recovery. She can get back to stage pretty easily. If you do miss timer or you know you press the button early or too late, then she is quite vulnerable yeah. to just dropping like a stone. To anything, yeah. Yeah. Oh my goodness, he's gone for the cheekiest Ooh. slaps off stage trying Ooh. to catch him. Trying to catch him out. But yeah, now he's playing this one a bit more defensively and amassing his lead. Oh, catches the rolling. What a great read from Q. Oh, and he's got it. And yeah, he's managed to put Patrick in bad spot one Maybe time and killed him for is, it. is really working for him. This is actually unreal. I can't believe he's he's been playing with so many characters. He's been building up, building up his repertoire. I, exactly. I, I'm just astounded. <laughs> Flabbergasted. <laughs> I don't know what to say anymore. But Blue is one of our best, and he's uh, Blue's got no idea how to combat this. He's got no idea. He's just <gasps> and there it is. He's air dodged off oh, and there stage it is. and just. Wow. He's down. 
Hughes looking well, that was pretty extremely, pleased with himself as well. That was an extremely effective switch, I must say. Yeah, just really got the upper hand and got the Far out. the shock factor. I'm shocked. He's definitely got the surprise. Oh my goodness. It's quite funny as well, like, um, that's a matchup, like, Patrick has pulled out the Donkey Kong against other Lucy's yeah. in the past. So seeing that get reversed <laughs> on him is like really quite, quite funny. funny. Is this another? He's, he's won the game and he switched. Wow. I'd, oh my god. Why wouldn't you? You just absolutely crushed him. Why would you not? Yeah, that was a stick crushing to it. victory. That was awesome. All right, whatever. He's, he's, he's really Samus. just wanting to to build up a lot here. This is the most ADHD set I've ever seen. This is like, insane. <laughs> All right, so another switch for Bex and Samus. I've and never known somebody to do this before. Oh. And it's not like he's playing, like, random. He's no. literally choosing specific characters that he seems to have been practicing with by himself. And now he's shocking us all. And if you try and pick his brain, he'll tell you, I don't know, the character's fun. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I don't know. <laughs> he doesn't have a good That's reason whatever, for it man. or whatever. He's just like, yeah, just, I don't know, I just, the I just thought it might be fun. <laughs> uh, Switch it up a bit. To start off with, the Samus isn't exactly working out in his favor. He tried playing it very aggressively at the start and just sort of gotten outranged by Lucina's great normals. Mm. Um, Samus is definitely a character where you basically just have to read and predict what your opponent is doing and place the hitbox in the right spot before they do the block. Yeah, yeah. It's all very much prediction based. So yeah. you see him go for a lot of um, fade back aerials and whatever else to try and catch him approaching. Much more of a mental game. Yeah, absolutely. With this character. Abs absolutely. Rather than just button mashing. <laughs> yeah, it's a uh, mental game and setups like that where uh, he saw Patrick had to air dodge the blast yep. and then punish that with a kick afterwards. Yeah, and that's what you want to do. So it's like keeping opponents in a really bad spot that they can't uh, actually recover from. Yeah, so you can just keep that upper hand and keep the lead against them. Yeah, absolutely. Now that he has a lead, he gets to play it rather defensively. Play how he likes. <laughs> and that's what uh, Samus tends to really excel at, is um, trying to play the keep away game yep. with Long range kicks and you know the blasts that she can shoot, whatever else. Yeah. Go rack up damage safely from a distance if she can. So yeah, I'm not surprised to see him. Ooh, good up B catching him over him. Um, yeah, it's not always easy to land on Samus either if you try and go for the aerial approach, like mm. jump off, jump over the blast or whatever. Yeah, you can yeah. get called out for that with yeah, um, sure. nice strong upwards hitboxes. Oh, gone super oh, deep wow. for it. Caught his jump. Very much so. Ah, uh, but Samus still has the recovery to make it back. Oh, great catch. Oh, They're both there. They're both there. Trying to catch the timing on the scene is like yeah, upward that swing. Was very so difficult. And he's just absolutely nailed it. Very impressive. Missed the tech on the trade, unfortunately. But uh, that's still kind of a win for him because he yeah. was down that stock. Unfortunately, though, it does mean that he doesn't have his lead anymore. Yep. Starting to... Oh, misses the tech. Gets yeah. a big punish for that one. Oh, he's missed the ledge. Oh, See what I mean? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's really too about timing. Yep. Too high, too low. You are very vulnerable. Timing and placement. Otherwise, it just messes it all up. Absolutely. Ooh, caught him jumping early. Bad air dodge on stage. Big risk Really air. could be anyone's game at this point. I, I'm just... Oh, big back air. Ooh. That's a strong move. Oh, got him! Does he have a jump? Does he? Oh, he's dead. There's no oh, way. He is. Yep, there yeah, it is. Wow. Big slash. Great wow. awareness from Patrick. Got yeah. him off stage and he really held him nice. there. And another really close game. Yeah. So even though Q's switching constantly, he's he clearly showing his proficiency. With the Donkey Kong, man. Oh, he absolutely still, crushed him in that one. I still think the Donkey Kong was, I mean, clearly stronger. Yeah. But, uh, I think possibly might have been more about the element of surprise rather than. Oh! Patrick's picked Donkey wow, Kong now. Wow, okay. The ditto. Are we gonna get the a ditto. The mirror. Are we going to get a double Donkey Is he going to do it? For the last game. Oh, go on. That's the Kahone's oh. pick right there. <laughs> Blue's Donkey Kong, extremely good. Yeah. Um, and practices his character for a few months. That's that's something that he really does know how to play. Yeah, not like the, ooh, Back to Samus. Stayed on Samus. Okay. Not sure if that's a good idea. This or can not go either way because like Donkey Kong is a big guy. He's gonna cop a lot of hits. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And, uh, I wouldn't be real confident playing it if, um, given the the last one though. Uh, 
See, Samus doesn't have... a different matchup. Samus doesn't have great options to get someone off of them once they're in, mm. but should be able to keep Donkey Kong out quite effectively. That's good, yeah. So, yeah, it's really going to be a matter of how well Patrick can get into Q's face and bully him, I think. Yeah. Oh, my goodness, see? <sighs> great up out of shit from Q. Caught him jumping on the approach. There's a great set. Down smash is a choice. That move is really bad. Ooh, caught him rolling. And jump. Oh my goodness. Patrick, out of options. Yeah, he's just keeping he's him stuck. there. He is completely stuck. Just keeping him right off the ledge. So it's incredibly effective at keeping Donkey Kong at bay at the moment. Yeah, he's doing Ooh. a great job of that. Read the jump. And there it is. I think that was weak dash attack. That wasn't even the strong hit and it just killed no, him. No, got him though. Wow, that's a really strong combo. Da Maybe Samus is the right choice for this. Mm, it's effective right now. That is it. It's just, about, it's just about how well Blue can get yeah. in, and he's just not letting him at the moment. Yeah. Not giving any room to breathe. Ooh, the up caught. Pretty surprising. Ah, uh, caught the spot dodge with the Nair. Patrick not really able to deal with the pressure right now. Yeah. Oh, and he's been dunked. There it is. Perfect spacing on that one. Substantial lead now for Q. Yeah, this is huge. He really All right, he caught this. it with that up air. Very large horizontal hitbox for an up air. But yeah. Can Patrick get it back though is really the Ooh. question. Can he get My in there? My goodness. Or is Sam just going to dominate him and keep him at bay? Yeah, look, he can't get in right now. He's, He's working. really struggling. It's definitely working. Oh, not laggy enough. Gonna get punched for that one. Oh my goodness, the big swing. Catches the air dodge, really smart play by Q. Great set play. Oh, he's caught him again. Man, wow, and he's Donkey got Kong it. sucks. He's got it. He is clean him up. Wow. That is a solid 3 2 for Q over blue. Outstanding. With so many different character switches throughout as well. <sighs> that was that was a display. That was a lot. That was definitely a display. I I think I'm up. Yeah, you go for it. Yeah, I think Hugh's really wanting to um to to prove himself this round and and show that he's got more than what people expect him to, and he's he's got more than than what 